I don't think there's probably a living creature on the planet that isn't more enriching to humans than birds. Doing what we can to protect them, especially from a threat that we humans have created, is my primary goal and my primary focus. First thing is to realize, you know, what is the problem? The problem is, is that birds behave, at least, as if glass, sheet glass in the form of windows, are invisible to them. So they reflect the facing habitat, and they're deceived by that, trying to fly to it. Or they see habitat on the other side of clear panes, like in an atria or a corridor, and they're deceived by that. It's the glass that really is the problem for them. So we have to transform the glass into a barrier that they'll see and avoid. There are thousands of people that walk into glass doors and windows, and, and they have the same problem that the birds do. In the case of the bird, they only have to be perched like a meter, a couple of feet away, and they can fly into a window and kill themselves outright. It's such a tragedy. So their visual system also is unique in the sense that it's a little bit more endowed than us humans. They can see ultraviolet light where we can't. Our lenses absorb that ultraviolet light. So that's why in the solution part, it's so important to develop a signal that would work. Uh, it is now being identified and there are glass manufacturers that are making windows that are bird safe and we want to encourage more of that. We have them here on our campus. The elegant solution, the one that I've written about for, for a long, long time, is to use signals that are not visible to humans but are to birds and those are ultraviolet signals that we place on the windows. That's still also a work in progress. Short-term solutions have to do with retrofitting existing panes all around the world. We have to do this to protect the animals that are dying by the millions every, you know, uh, every year. And then we've got long-term solutions. Those are the ones where we're developing new sheet glass that's going to be placed in remodeled buildings and new construction. And it's that, that area that the ultraviolet signals that we're, we're trying to work for. The visual system of birds is unbelievably remarkable. Uh, we could say the same thing about ourselves. But the facts are, every backboned animal, from fish to humans and birds in between, they just don't seem to be able to see glass as a barrier to be avoided. We have to make it become a barrier that they can see and avoid.